good morning and thank you for stepping into the file playland as always i'm your file player um wanted to make this video regarding uh or another video regarding uh gary russell man and an opinion that i had um about him which i'm pretty sure you've assumed where i'm heading at with the uh title of this video um gary russell jr the fucking fantastic fighter man i um Pound for pound I mean uh, I don't get to see him that often Because he doesn't fight that often um, Supposedly it's because of uh, Problems that he has with his hands um, And he doesn't want to take injuries With fights that uh, aren't worthwhile Whatever um, But the times that I have seen him fight That man tears dudes apart bro Like the uh, He doesn't look like he hits very hard But shit If that motherfucker knows how to set traps uh, plays his shots fucking extremely well. Gary Russell is a fucking problem, bro. He's been a problem. Um, having said that, Gary Russell is uh, a little bit on the older side. I mean, it's, um, in the uh, latter half of his career, at the very least. If not, with these medical problems that he has, he may be in the twilight of his career. Um, the Leo Santa Cruz callout was fantastic, as I say, stated in my... Uh, Last video If you haven't checked that out Please do Um The fact about Tank Davis Even better Fucking uh The fact that he dissed Mayweather Woo wee Fucking fantastic Do more bro Fucking uh Ratchet your name up as, as much as you could Fucking um But um In um Recently I know he sat Next to um Eddie Hearn at a uh, fight Not sure which fight um, I don't give a shit Fucking um, Also um, Before I go any further If you've uh, watched any of my uh, Past videos You'll know that I think Fucking Nothing of Eddie Hearn I think Eddie Hearn's a piece of shit I think Eddie Hearn's Blocking the best fight uh, From being made In, in uh, Wilder and uh, Joshua Which was the best fight at one point Now it's uh, not. We're not there all the way but he's still a bitch fuck Eddie Hearn having said that um um I Gary Russell Jr. should fucking at least tempt that he's gonna fucking sign with Eddie Hearn if not all the way sign with Eddie Hearn um I'm not sure what uh what a Gary Russell makes with the fights that he's taking now um I'm pretty sure it's not nowhere fucking in uh near the five hundred thousand dollar mark um, including back end money Like that they say that these PVC guys make Fuck that I mean if you can make double that Like fucking um, fighting with Eddie Hearn Or uh, The Zone or Matchroom Especially if it's on a fight by fight basis Gary fucking jump Dip off man Like fucking at least tempt these dudes That you're gonna do that shit At least uh, put it out there That you're uh, interested in doing that Fucking um, Mikey Garcia just did the same shit he fucking sat next to uh, uh, Eddie Hearn um, on the zone card, if I remember correctly. Fucking, um, actually, I think it was for the Joshua fight when he got his uh, ass tore up. Um, I mean, correct me if I'm wrong. Fucking, um, but um, I'm not sure if one if that led to um, um, Mikey getting more interest. I'm pretty sure it did though. I mean, like, at that time, Mikey uh, Garcia was flirting with fucking, um, with top rank, supposedly, like, to, to, to re-sign with them. Um, there were rumors that he was considering going to the zone. Um, he sat next to Eddie Hearn at the, um, at that fight ringside, like, for the world to see. Um, fast forward a couple months later, it's rumored that he's gonna be one of the people that may get a fight with Pacquiao. I mean, that's a dream scenario, fucking... You're getting your ass whooped uh, by Errol Spence on a pay-per-view and then tempt, uh, uh, putting it out there that you're willing to um, to, to, to go um, to another network or to another promotion company and uh, you get rewarded with a fucking Pacquiao fight on the heels of taking a loss. Like, fuck it, bro. Like, fucking, uh, you know, you like Gary Russell Jr.'s record is damn near unblemished. Like, if you, if you factor... A Lomachenko loss Like Lomachenko Like Has his dick down Enough people's throats Like fucking Where people are Overrating this dude Like crazy 
So you're getting you got beat by one guy that everybody's uh willing to fucking uh overrate. Um have him as the number one pound for pound. Besides that, every other fight uh Gary Russell had um, he beat the shit out of fucking everybody And he looks fantastic doing so You need a mouthpiece Like fucking uh, um, Like fucking Hearn in, in, in some cases Like fucking That'll drum up like um, um, Fanfare for you Fuck it bro do it Like I mean like Times are wasting If you could do it on a fight by fight basis Even better bro Like fucking uh, If you could uh, 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 Smack Tevin Campbell in the process I mean uh, um, Fucking do Yeah Correct his fucking cross-eyed ass too, man. I mean, shout out to Kevin Campbell, man. I, 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 I think he gets a lot of flack, bro. But fucking, I think he's uh doing admirable things, like fucking for himself, bro. Fuck it. But um, if if um uh, the zones, I mean, and it's th- like these dudes that are going to the zone are fighting ass cheeks fighters anyway. You may fucking uh get four wins on the zone in a matter of a uh, a year or two. I mean, yeah, it's not gonna be great opposition. But um, you'll you'll be uh, you'll have somebody as your mouthpiece, fucking um, drumming up the fact that you're the best fighter in the world, um, and you collect them checks, bro. If you could walk away from that uh, 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 the zone deal with like three fights and two million bucks, for fuck it, go, go, like dip off, man. Like fucking, you know, every everything's not a uh, eternal, man. Especially your uh, boxing career. And you're getting zero love on PBC. Sorry, I mean I, I I love the PBC too, bro. I think they're doing great things for boxers, but in this current landscape, they ain't doing shit for Gary Russell Jr. Tevin Cam, Te, uh, Tevin, Tevin Campbell, bro. What the fuck? Tevin Farmer is making more bread than Gary Russell Jr. right now. I'm pretty sure. Like fucking like like, and that shouldn't be the case, bro. Like, you know, Farmer got a. Uh, 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 Several losses under his under his belt already, bro. Like fucking, and Gary Russell Jr. would fucking wash this dude, bro. Like the you know it's 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 a shame, man. Like fucking, I think Gary Russell Jr. could beat Lomachenko, bro. Like uh, it, if if they if they were to run that back, if they were if Lomachenko had the balls and went down to one thirty, and I uh, and Gary Russell move uh, moves up, especially if he had a fight under his belt. Um, before he touched with Lomachenko, I think he could beat Lomachenko. The um, Lom- like um, but it is what it is, man. I, I don't see these dudes um being lined up to fight uh Gary Russell, man. It's it's, it's a shame, man. I mean, at least I, like I, if even if they fed a Mares, that'd be fucking fantastic for this dude, bro. And um, I'm I'm sorry too, but um, damn, what's his face? Um, whoever the fuck's daddy he just ran up on, he ain't shit either, man. Like yo, like fucking, or maybe and maybe Eddie Hearn will line him up with some of these uh, English guys, like um, that are um, near that weight class, bro. Like fucking, uh, you know, in the UK, like fuck it, bro. Like go, like dip off, man. Like do do what you do. If it, even if it if it if it if it um drums up rancor. From people that don't like Eddie Hearn, I fucking hate Eddie Hearn, bro. Like fucking uh, but uh, I the last fight Gary Russell Jr. had, I almost missed that shit. I didn't even know he was fighting. Like fucking uh, oh, I didn't know I didn't know he was fighting on that card. Like uh, but why? Well, not that I didn't know. I may have just for, almost forgotten. Like like it didn't have it wasn't drummed up like that. Like fucking I didn't give a shit about it like that until I watched it and he and he performed his ass off. So go do what you do, man. Like fucking, they ain't no allegiances like that, man. Like fucking, like with this PBC shit too, man. Like they, they, they. Uh, like sorry to say, bro. And I, and shout out to all my Latin cats. I'm fucking Puerto Rican to the core, bro. Like fucking, but they hooking up these Latin cats, bro. Like fucking, all these guys. Like yo, how the fuck does Abner Morris got a, a a fucking like a a mainstay job on fucking this PBC shit, bro? Abner Morris is fucking whack, bro, and he doesn't even do a good job. That that shit. It's not like Abner Morris has this fucking great insight for uh, it's overrated, man. Like fucking dude, he was a, he's a hat. Uh, never was. He was a, a fucking somebody who was overrated as shit. Like fucking uh, and 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 it didn't pan out. Like fucking like hook somebody hook. Even if you're not hooking up Gary Russell Jr. necessarily, man. Like that like these like these cats shouldn't have 
Like, Abner Morris shouldn't have that job, bro. Sorry. Fuck him, bro. Like, fucking, like, have him call, like, fights here and there, man. But give, give those mainstay jobs in the studio with the, with the PBC Weekly shows to somebody else, bro. Fuck these cats, bro. Like, fucking, like, and, and I mean, like, and I, I somewhat see the logic if, if, if these things were being consummated or if my next logic were being consummated. And that is, if you were fucking um, beefing up these Latin cats to become opposition for some of these brothers that are nasty, I'd be with it. But that's not happening. You know what I'm saying? Like fucking, uh, cause a lot, you know, a lot of these fights, with when it's a, a Latin, uh, a Mexican cat and, and a brother, or a Latin cat and a brother, I mean, they gener- they they tend to generate a little bit more fanfare. So if you were keeping these Latin cats fat to fucking um to 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 become the um, the eventual food for some of these like uh brothers that are that are really nasty i.e. Gary Russell Jr. or i.e. Danny Garcia for uh Errol Spence or for um whoever the fuck like I'd be with it bro but fucking they're, they're not like they're just having these guys like in the broadcast booth um paying them well like fucking motherfuckers don't even gotta get into a ring getting too picky with their opposition and like you're wasting that fucking uh that job on on a on a bum on a bum it's not like there's like fucking uh it, it, you need to placate to a a latin audience for these pbc shows pbc gets mostly love from the brothers man like fucking placate to to the to the brothers or, or at least to the fucking guys who look like the brothers goddamn all right bro with that i'm out bro i don't want to get uh i, I don't want to get flagged or some shit fucking um or people think I'm selling out my peeps, man. Like, fucking... Shout out to all my Latinos, bro. Like, fucking too, bro. Love y'all. And uh, shout out to y'all for watching this video. Make sure you uh, check out my other shit, too, man. If you could. I, I gotta stop lacking, too. As far as my video making, man. Peace, man. I, I gotta piss. Later.